let's set up some proxy picking. Now we will get back to the item shapes we created for the footnails. Open the scene editor. Lock both foot guides to make it easier to select the overlapping bones. Select asterisk foot underscore master underscore L. Open the master plugins panel. Open the add layout, pull down, and select proxy pick. Proxy pick has been added to the plugin list. Double click proxy pick and two more pull downs will appear below. Make the proxy object asterisk foot underscore master underscore L. Then make the target item heel underscore L. Then apply label. Add another proxy pick instance. Make the proxy object asterisk foot underscore master underscore R. Make the target item heel underscore R. Then apply label. Add another proxy pick instance. Make the proxy object asterisk foot underscore ball underscore L. Make the target item foot underscore piv underscore L. Then apply label. Add another proxy pick instance. Make the proxy object asterisk foot underscore ball underscore R. Make the target item foot underscore piv underscore R. Then apply label. Add another proxy pick instance. Make the proxy object asterisk toe underscore L. Make the target item toe underscore L. Then apply label. Add another proxy pick instance. Make the proxy object asterisk toe underscore R. Make the target item toe underscore R. Then apply label. Close the master plugin panel. Now, when you try to select a proxy shape, you will automatically be redirected to the bone or object assigned to it. Once the proxy picking is turned on, you won't be able to select these rings again. You will only be able to select what they're directing you to. If you want to edit the color or size of the visual cues in the future, you will have to turn the proxy picking off. And that's it. Ta-da!